back to the coaching journey in Bali Ben. Whirlwind of a season. Two wins in a row. Four losses in a row. Three wins in a row. And Tennessee Tech, 3-3 three and three in the division. And let's go check out where their opponent is going to be. The only independent in F S FCS football. Kennesaw, 6-4 and four on the season. Where are they ranked in this grand scheme of things? Do 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 do. Tennessee Tech fifty five, Kennesaw eighty three at six and four. All right, so big game here, big opportunity. Get to six and four, guarantee yourself a winning year. That's what we're going for today. Big football, big game here in Cookville in a rainy, muggy day. But here we go. Offense is looking good as of late. Nice to have another three-game winning streak. Try to make it four. Oh, boy. They're going for a big play right away. Jameson Blair. And that pretty much sums it up. Oh, touchdown. Down. Okay. So here's the strategy. Down 14 points. You got to go score here. You got to take up the clock. You can't let them get any more points in the half. You get the ball at halftime. That's true. So what are you going to do? Methodical drive. Use the clock. No more turnovers. You're not done yet. Not done yet here. All right. Don't lose faith. And Jamison just kept on going. All right. Third down and in inches. Get it back to that running back. Had a pretty good season so far. Excitement goes a little bit down when you have a first play of the game turnover. But there we go. Get it back to where you're at. Running back. It's a running kind of game. It's rainy. It's muggy. Let the defense feel it. Let your offensive line go to work. And Kemp again. Letting it happen. All right. Anawalu. Tight end. Makes it happen there. All right. Get it back out to Kemp. Kemp splits the defender. Stays in bounds. Let the clock tick. All right. I gotta let the clock tick here. Then he's tackled immediately. Give me third down and four. No gain. Give me fourth down and one. All right. So big. This is the game right here, folks. This is gonna be the game. Keeps it himself. Dives in there. Under a minute to go. There we go. We got some downs. They can get a first down without scoring. That's important also. So you don't need all of them. Don't need all the yards. But use the clock. Use the clock. Need some yards here. All right. There we go. Third down and five. A little more manageable. Anualu gets the first down. Let's the clock tick. There you go. Again, it's always a gamble. You want to get the points when you can get the points. But you want to... You want to melt the clock a little bit. Right, you want to melt the clock just a little bit. And they do it as much as they can. Perfect use of the clock. And two-point conversion is good. All right. So strategy so far worked. And it's get to get the ball back. So there you go. Two for one opportunity. And you're right back in it. So just got to be careful here. Keep to the plan. Don't panic. Down by 14. You know, if you're going to make mistakes, make it early. Don't make them late. Let the clock be your friend. And hit immediately. All right, so you can go out there and play some football right now. All right, that's what they can do. And be careful with the football. Again, defenders are swarming. Kennesaw out to try to win. And I got to go audible here. Audible looks good, is good. And again, it's going to be a crucial play. going to be fourth down in inches. And they get it out to their shoe running back. Kemp, the freshman, is doing it all. Anawalu helping out as well. Gain of 11. Wide receivers are being held in check in this game. Um, oh, spoke too soon. Jameson Blair, that ball was not for him, but selfishly he goes out and gets it. Dive, makes the dive, hopefully. And again, this guy's had a little fumbleitis in his career, so... Gets down, or teaching them that. Like, don't even take a hit. Just go for the dive, right? Dive. Third down and one. Big third down and one here. And Jose Hansey takes it himself. 
All right, you want to score here in the third quarter, right? You want to give yourself some time in the fourth quarter so you give yourself a chance. That's the idea here. Give yourself a chance. Die making it happen. Out of bounds. Going back to Die once again. Inside, outside. Touchdown, Die. Tie game, baby. Again, methodic. Methodical. Two-point conversion is good. Die came back to it. Tennessee Tech takes the lead. Fourth quarter is coming. And they don't get the two. So here it is. The chance at redemption. Minute 20 to go. You're up by, you're down by four. So a touchdown wins it. Field goal does nothing. So use the time. You got to get a touchdown. So the pressure is there. Anawalu is not able to execute there. Jamison Blair up on the top of your screen. The senior. It's out of bounds. It's going to be third down and two. Where are you going with it? Nowhere to go with it. Over the top. Kemp gets it. Out of bounds. Under a minute to go. All right. Nice touch. Uh-oh. And that's the game. Field goal will be... Nope. Not an option. There's the game. Get turnovers, man. They're going to cost you. They're going to cost you every single time. Oh, can't get the timing route in. And we're going to go into the last week of the season trying to get a winning season against one of the best teams in FCS. Oh, boy. Jameson Blair out of bounds. Dangerous throw. Blair, 22 yards in the air. And Kennesaw comes up big with two turnovers in the game. They had the game plan. It's on me, the coaches, you know. Ah, oh, tough, tough loss there. Two interceptions. And Jameson Blair, pretty much all-out player, balling out. And let's just go check the rankings out. Lorman is no longer the top team in all the land. They fell out a little bit. Where do they go? Lost a couple games in a row. So they're 11th, but... All right, see you guys next week for the chance to get to 500 or over 500 winning season on the line.